Hello everyone, thank you for joining us again for another one of our BFT Tech videos. Today we will be going over the FL130B and the UL Photo Beam hookup. These are your FL130B setup. Uh, I want to quickly go over the wiring because this uh, we get quite a few calls on this and it's actually just a simple fix. Uh, so for the most part, I just want to go over. This is a Deimos A600 AUL. This is the same setup regardless of whatever UL uh, control board you have from BFT. Uh, so let's go over your wiring real quick. This side, the side that has five cables, is your receiver side. And the side that has two cables is your transmitter side. All right. When you take a look on the inside, it's very important again on your trans or receiver side that you have five cables, not four, five. Of course, your power goes to your first two. One and two is your power. Three, right there, that white cable, that is your common. Four, right here, your brown cable, that, believe it or not, ladies and gentlemen, is your normally open, not your normally closed. Uh, I know the Italian manual says the opposite, but here in the States, this is normally open, and your number five, your green cable here, is your normally closed, all right? Another quick uh, example or uh, tip I wanna give you guys is if you're bench testing this, and you wanna make sure everything's working, make sure you use the FL130B side to side, all right? Don't point them towards each other, they're not gonna see each other. They have to be at least four inches apart if you're gonna point them towards each other, but this is the quickest and easiest way uh, to just bench test your unit. Uh, now we go over here. If you notice, your transmitter side, the side that only had two cables, you'll look right here, you'll notice your negative is in 50 and your positive is in 52. That is for the transmitter side only. Now moving on to the receiver side. You have your negative in your 50, and you have your positive in your 51, okay? This part is very important. The powers have to be separated or you'll still get it ER01, ER04. Let's continue. The other part of your wires, uh, common, if you remember from earlier, goes to 70. Your normally closed, which is number five, goes to 72. And then last but not least, your normally open, which was number four, goes to 73. And last little tip, make sure you remove the jumper and only the jumper from 70 and 72. The only time you remove any of these jumpers is if you're using that spot. If not, the jumpers have to remain. Uh, thank you very much. And let's check if we did this correct. And we're good to go. All right, thank you.